Hello everyone and welcome back to Death Stranding. This is part 22. In the last episode we built a safe house just right over there in that direction. And in this episode, well let's figure out what we're doing in this episode. Uh, let's make a bot uh, order. Yes. Sweet. The automation revolution. Okay. Um, 75%. Oh, wait. Projected post delivery damage of 75%. Wow. Um, let's not do those. Save those and let's go to. Let's go here. Yeah. Oops, I pressed... Sorry. Okay, and then just confirm nothing. Oh, load all. Auto. Load it. Okay, confirm. Yep. Order assigned. Okay. Let's open up the map. Okay. Okay, let's see. How do I do this? Is it down? Nope. Um, isn't square triangle? No, no. There we go. Right stick. Okay, it doesn't seem like there's any rain. Oops. At all. Okay, cool. Maybe like off to the edges, but if I can take this straight line, then there shouldn't be any rain. Alright, so we're gonna go to the... To the... Time fall farm here. Find a safe way down here. There we go. There we go. Okay. To the weather station. I guess it'd be nice if we were going the other way. There's that safe house that I built. And yeah, so let's just kind of follow this road here. There we go. So just go up this hill here. Predicting the weather is akin to predicting the future. Some animals have a kind of sixth sense that helps them to avoid danger. But we have something far better. The ability to gather data and act accordingly. Only humans possess this power to plan ahead. We have the capacity to live each day imagining what tomorrow will be like. And our imagination once gave rise to a rich, vibrant culture. But somewhere along the line, we lost sight of tomorrow. We reduced ourselves to animals, focused only on the here and now. It is nice that we can uh, predict, or we can check the data, the, sorry, the weather. Oh wow, we still have a long ways. Alright. Yeah, I kind of want to be picking up some of these materials, but I also don't. Okay, so I'm going to be muting the audio and I'm putting own music over this. So you guys won't be hear hearing game audio for a little bit. I do apologize about that.
Oke. Okay. So let's see. Okay, I think we're going there. Oh, I lost a bunch of stuff. I lost a bunch of stuff in the last episode? No, no, two episodes ago. Uh, when I fell down the... Fell under the river. Well, I didn't fall into the river. I walked into the river. And it was a little deeper than I expected. So I lost a bunch of stuff there. What is that? Ooh, extra large. Nope. I might grab that small ceramics and take it to the, um... To the spot here. Those are vehicles. Um... Okay. That looks like a mule base up to the right. Okay. It's probably going to be mule territory. Do I have a weapon? Okay, I do. Okay. I'm actually going to unequip it. But it's good to know that I have it. I'm gonna go walk over here and... Figure out what this is. Oh. I think it's mule territory? Another bullet gun. Let's grab the bullet gun. Yeah, this is 100% mule territory. Playing cargo high makes it hard to hide. Yep. Okay, there's a car right there. Force the driver to unseat. Okay, yeah, we're definitely doing that. Wait, hold up. Alright, come here, car. That didn't look good, okay. Okay, in the car, in the car. Let's go. Okay, I see it. Hopefully I'm faster than that car. Oh jeez. <laughs> How am I gonna make it through this? Oh, this is it. Oh, you know you guys have like mules like right outside. But yeah, okay, okay. I was just trying to balance myself. Okay. Deliver requested cargo. Thank you. 
Bridges has always been so good to us. Amelie was a dear friend in the early days. She saw the value in what we were doing and led the effort to get our farm up and running. We've been waiting a long time to join the Chiral Network. Let's have a look at that wheat you brought, shall we? Well, I'll be. Did you really bring us this much? How on earth did you manage? Oh, bless you. Okay. What I'm going to do right now, uh, since we're in this screen, is I'm going to reset my capture card because there's a tear. I can see the tear in the thing. I don't know how long that's been there. I do apologize about that. But once this stops here, just so you guys aren't missing anything. Okay. Nope. If I skip it. Okay. I'm going to stop it right here. I'm going to fix that tear and I'll be right back. Okay. Sorry about that. Hopefully that fixed it up. Okay, got a great mover. You've bridge link 50. By the way, you wouldn't happen to know Fragile, would you? If you see her, pass along a message for us. Tell her, thanks for saving our hides. If she hadn't stepped up, South Knots and our farm would have been wiped off the face of the earth. She's a hero. And you can tell her I said so. All right, the network. Think you can get us online? Okay, new strand established. The Timefall farm is during the ECA. So Sam, you've been run down by mules after they pinged your cargo, right? Well, to help prevent that from happening again, we've upgraded your own cargo scanner. Say you're about to get pinged. If you time it right, you can return the favor and cancel out their pulse with your own. They'll be none the wiser and you can carry on without worry. Timing is everything though. Okay, that's cool. Okay, the area is now connected to the Carol network, enabling you to see and access other player structures, etc. Oh, thank you. Now to start really using Timefall to our advantage. Our farm will be a world first. Truth be told, we've got some test fields, but without the ability to predict Timefall, the results have been less than stellar. The time fall around here was fairly regular, so we had a reasonable idea of when to plant and when to harvest. But then the terrorists went and threw everything out of whack. Too many dead, too many craters. Weather became impossible to predict. The network's forecast ought to help us get back on track, thank goodness. If all goes to plan, we'll be able to expand our operation and use time fall to cultivate whole swaths of land. We'll continue our genetic research, too, of course, and see if we can't find a way to help develop a sustainable ecosystem. Hell, maybe we'll even stumble into some answers about the time fall while we're at it. We got our work cut out for us, but I'm up for the challenge. Thanks again, Sam. You've given us hope for a better tomorrow. <laughs> I can't wait for the harvest. That's the way, Sam. Halfway there. You can do it. Huh? Well, would you look at that? You've only just brought the Timefall farm into the network and already we've got new orders. May as well make use of the return trip. Good work. New order available. Please okay. access... Oh. Okay, just standard. Uh, where do I need to go? I need to go back to the weather station. Uh, so we're just going to go... I need to go back there eventually. Is this... Oh, it's fragile. Now let's just go back to the weather station. And I'm still in this car. Oh, it's raining too. Okay. 
Alright, let's set a root back. The weather station. Yeah. Construction zone. What are you trying to build? I feel like I should be able to pass like undetected in this as long as I don't get too close to anybody like they they shouldn't know that I'm not one of them oh my goodness See, there's got to be a better way up this mountain. Maybe. Maybe not. Can you pick stuff up from outside the vehicle? It'd be kind of cool to play co-op and have somebody like hang off the side and just like pick stuff up and throw it in the back of the truck. Or even have like a like a robot, like scooper arm. Alright, I think this is the hill that we're going up. I think that's the white, or like the bright, I don't know, it's kind of like blue, white blue-ish is where we're going. I'm hoping we can make it without running out of battery here. Battery's running out. Okay, if the battery runs out, we'll just walk the rest of the way. I guess I could try to make a, um, a generator. There's a safe house. Is this thing? Is this thing a generator? Yeah. Wait, no, oh. Sweet. Okay, so we're almost back. Move the top here. Weather station. Okay. Activate the terminal. Uh, orders for Sam. Go into the distribution center. I don't know what a VOG is. That container is filled with pressurized VOG. If it breaks, the gas will begin to leak out. Which is bad news for you and anyone near you. Therefore, it's imperative you keep this cargo in good condition. Pack some extra repair spray just to be sure. In Oops. 
Bog is vital to the work of our R&D division. Deliver it safely and you might end up contributing to the creation of some new equipment for yourself. Okay. Um... Alright, we're gonna auto arrange it. Alright, what I would like to do. Oh, that's damaged bad. Okay. Is drop some of this stuff. So let's confirm this. Yes. Okay. And then recycle the resins. Um. Like, if I recycle these... I get that material, right? Like, I'll get the 200... I would assume. Okay, yeah, that's exactly what I wanted. Okay, cool. Um, just want to make sure everything else is good. I can just put it in the cargo shelf. Um, okay. Okay. Thank you for your contribution. Let's do this. And then, manage cargo. Okay. No, cancel. Okay. So with that being said, that's going to be it for today's episode. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, be sure to give, give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more, be sure to subscribe to the channel. If you have something to say, please leave me a comment down below and hope to see you guys in the next one.